Yeah. I'm just tryna say what it is for. No fake shit, baby, on the real though. Took two shots, really gifted. Two plus to the face, got me lifted. Got me lifted. Two plus to the face, got me lifted. Got me lifted. Two plus to the face. What's good, y'all? It's your boy Double D back at it again with another video. Look, I am no longer a YouTuber or a hooper no more. I gave that up. You know what I'm saying I'm officially I'm a skater now. Like, do I know how to skate? I don't. But is we finna learn how to skate? We is. I know how I know how to do a little something, something for me. I know how not to fall. That's all that really matters. So yeah, as we finna do, we finna ride. We finna ride the board today and get active let me show y'all let me show y'all what i could do see i told y'all told y'all i could do a little something, something so first trip we're gonna uh we're gonna go to 7-eleven first uh, let's get it Why he talking shit cause I got more money than him I don't wanna be like him I don't wanna be like him Do it feel different when I put it in Do you like me cause of my Benjamin? Alright, I just made it 7-Eleven Look, this is what skaters do Skaters go like this Oh wait Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on Yeah I'm a skater skater I gotta put my mask on R.I.P. Kobe I'm gonna hit some of this Gatorade right here, Kev. Oh, it's Gatorade Zero, Kev. This ought to been sick. Kev, where's the regular Gatorade at, fool? Oh, well. Second best option, yellow. They don't got the regular blue one, Kev. I'm trying to hit the park, Kev, but everything up here, everything up here is uphill, nigga. This is some exercise, bro. My legs is burning, kid. I don't know how y'all do this. I don't know how people do this all day. My legs hurt. Oh, look at my arm, sexy. But yeah, the park is all the way up over there. But the gym's not open, so we're gonna have to get the we getting the workout in either way. You feel me? Let's go. They don't want to see a young nigga prosper. Oh, look at my chest, kid. Oh, look at my chest. Stop playing with me. Oh, well, bro. It's hot as it's hot in the mug out here. My legs hurt. Nigga, you look like a fish out of water, fella. I wonder what that do. I need to do some of those. It's hot, it's hot as hell on the ground, though. I know, bro, skin burning. This video is sponsored by Gatorade. Oh, that hit. Oh, 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 all right. I guess I'm about to head back to the crib, Kev, because I'm getting blacker out here. Honestly, I don't think I was supposed to be this dark. I think two days from football made me like this because I, I, I really don't think I was meant to be this dark. But it's okay. I'll take it. You know what I'm saying? Look at me. I'm sexy. Stop playing with me. Pop. All right, so I was just minding my own business, right? My own business. And this video pops up in my DMs and somebody wanted me to watch this video. Now by the title, I don't know what kind of wild stuff he finna say in this video, real men 
because I consider myself a real man. And I feel like that's not what real men do. You know what I'm saying? I don't got no, nothing against the LGBTQ, I said it right, community. I don't want to fit nobody, but this title is wild. So I just want to see what he going to say to justify this title. I said the realest nigga alive. That's a hard intro. I woke up in the mirror this morning. I'm like, you know, I'm looking a little bit sexy. You know what I'm saying? So I start teasing myself a little bit. I start putting down my box a little bit. All and right. I'm looking, I'm like, oh, my shit looking dumb fat. Like, to be honest. I could have went my whole life without knowing that, but it's cool. I, I guess, love yourself, I guess. I was, if I was a girl, I would, I would suck my shit. I really would. What? I, I mean, I'll hear bro I'll, I'll hear about uh, And then I thought to myself I said hmm If I was a nigga I think I would still Suck my shit And then I thought to myself Matter of fact I'm about to suck my shit Right fucking now And I started thinking Hey yo Hey yo Mike What are you talking about bro Do people really do that I thought that was just a joke and I don't even know how to suck dick. Like, how can I consider myself a real man? Because at the end of the day, when you were alpha male, you know how to do everything. You know what I'm saying? When you were alpha male, you have to know if a nigga's cute. If you're walking down the street with your girl and a nigga's cute and he says hi to your shorty and you're like, oh, that nigga ugly. And every man is ugly to you because you're so straight. How are you going to know who's a threat? How are you going to know what's competition in your real niggerness? You feel me? So you gotta give credit where it's due. You gotta know if a nigga's cuter than you. That part I agree with. Not the whole competition thing, because I ain't in competition with nobody but myself. But that part where people think they so straight, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you know there are dudes out here that look better than you. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna go out here calling anybody ugly, because I know, bro, if all the hoes like them, they obviously not ugly. I, like Chris Brown, Drake, no homo, Trey Songs, you know what I'm saying? There's some, there's some good looking dudes. You can't take that away from them. And they will take your girl like like that. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, you can't just go around hating. Like, I know if somebody look good or somebody don't look good. I ain't, that don't mean, that don't make me gay. I just, you know what I'm saying? I just, I just know that they attract the people. That's all. Um, you got to know if a nigga's attracted. That's what an alpha male's being about. It ain't gay. It's just knowing your competition. And to keep it a buck, you got to know how to suck dick. If you all right. Real so man, you just you ruined me? it. Before y'all start going ape shit, let me explain myself. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, y'all know that I take shit that y'all niggas think is wrong. And I make that shit right. Because at the end of the day, I'm the realest nigga alive. And I overexpose shit that y'all niggas never saw before. Now, if you walking down the street and you in the struggle, OD, like you broke. Niggas is about to evict you next month type shit. And a rich white nigga walks up to you and he says, I give you a billion dollars if you suck my dick right now. First of all, that nigga ain't even asking you for how long you should suck that shit. Hypothetically speaking, that nigga tells you five minutes. Would you rather be gay for five minutes or stupid for life? Because if you don't <laughs> suck that dick and you're giving up a billion dollars, you're a fucking idiot. But a billion dollars, I could buy me a whole new fucking mouth. I'll take the five minutes of faggotry. Thank you very much. I'm dead sucking that dick. I promise you, if you a real nigga and you stay talking about that you getting this paper, you gonna do whatever it takes, you feel me? Cause money's the motive, you feel me? Talking all this shit about you getting paper, and at the moment that there's opportunity to get paper, you ain't gonna do that shit. At the end of the day, it's a gay action. What you do doesn't make you gay, it's the intentions behind it. It's whether you like it or not. Nah, that's gay, bro, but ow, oh, a billion dollars and you broke? That's tough! You feel me? I could kiss a nigga. That don't make me gay. I could fuck a nigga in his ass if I wanted to. That don't mean I'm gay. I could just do it just to do it. And I'll still be straighter than a fucking pencil. If you're giving me money, why not? I get this money. I'm about this money life. You feel me? Y'all niggas stay talking about y'all about this money life, but y'all powered by bitches. Y'all bitch made ass niggas. Do anything for pussy. You feel me? Do anything to look good for pussy. Talking about, nah, I'm straight, my nigga. What I look like going to my girl talking about that I just sucked dick for this billion dollars. Nigga, fuck that bitch. <laughs> you got a billion dollars, you could buy yourself a billion bitches with that. But I wouldn't buy a billion bitches, you feel me? I'm not a bitch made nigga. I'm not out here trying to impress women. I'm not trying to get women. I'm about this paper, you feel me? <laughs> when you get paper, when you chase the money, women follow. When you chase women, you losing money, you feel me? I forgot who said that shit. I think it was like Kane Carter or some shit. 
for spoken reasons. It was one of them black niggas, but they some real ass <laughs> niggas, you feel me? Gotta give credit where it's due, you feel me? Niggas can't chop me with that fucking copyright bullshit. Scenario number two. You walking down the street, it's two o'clock at night, and five niggas come up to you, and they say, give it up. You take out your wallet, they say, I'm not talking about that. Them niggas wanna fuck you. You gotta hit them niggas with the alternative, like, yo, I can't at least suck y'all niggas dicks or some shit. Right. Like they're not trying to get fucked. See, no, no. No, like what? Nah, you're gonna have to kill me, bro. And that's not even on no over masculinity, masculinity type, but I'm going out with a fight at least, bro. I ain't just for the. Bro, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, you know, I ain't going for that, but I see where you're coming from. Kinda. Kinda. And now, first of all, I got a phobia of blood. <laughs> Second of all, if you getting fucked in your ass, that's enough time for you to start liking that shit because there's a prostate gland right there. That's the male G spot, you feel me? You're going to start liking that shit and then you're just going to start getting fucked by niggas on the regular. In any situation, not for money, not for nothing. You're just going to start wanting to get fucked. And I don't want to get fucked, you feel me? That's just not because it's gay because at the end of the day, it's not the action that makes you gay, it's the intentions. But only because I don't want to waste my time. That time that I'm wasting wanting to get fucked by niggas, I could just be getting more paper, you feel me? And I I'm not a prostitute. I'm not gonna charge niggas to fuck me in my ass, you feel me? But if you just sucking dick for money, that's just being like a food tester, you feel me? You doing the a ice food cream test? You just sucking the cone for a little bit for, for some money, you feel me? Glizzy Gobbler, Glizzy Demon, Glizzy Demolisher them feedback on how they taste. If you getting fucked, that's just straight up prostitution. So yeah, at the end of the day, you gotta know how to suck dick. I don't understand, like, if it's a life or death situation, like, why would you not rather suck the dick you suck five dicks for a little bit for like five minutes rather than getting fucking plowed by like five niggas. I'd rather suck the dick, you feel me? I'm not getting it in my ass, you feel me? Because if you sucking dick, you sucking dick, that shit don't hurt. Sucking dick don't hurt. Getting fucked in your ass. My brother put things in the worst case scenario though. It's like, like, come on, bro. Like, you didn't really give people no options. Definitely gonna fucking hurt you for like the first 30 seconds, you feel me? I don't know about the rest of the time because I never got fucked in my ass. I suck dick, so I never had to deal with that shit. The smart bitches are the ones that suck dick because they don't gotta get fucked. They don't gotta waste energy, you feel me? They just suck the dick and make that nigga nut right away, you feel me? The better you are sucking dick, the faster them niggas nut, you feel me? And then the job is done, you feel me? If a nigga offered you a billion dollars, would you not suck that nigga dick if he said, I'll give you a billion dollars? To suck my dick. It's a billion fucking dollars, nigga. I could buy you an esophagus with half of that money. <laughs> really get me tight, yo. Anyway, it's been real, everybody. It was the realest.